Hear me very well. Yes, a lot of people have applauded the fact that the CBN under investigation and the you know unraveling of the mysterious things that are amazing people to 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 whatever level it has been. But yeah, there are still criticisms that. Why is the NNPC also not being investigated? Is it because the president is the minister of the, you know, NNPC? And then also, why, are, why is it that, you know, uh, ministers or directors of very uh, critical government-owned enterprises and, uh, and ministries of the last administration are not also being investigated? Uh, uh, Mr. Ogedegbe, as we close, I want you to put your comment <coughs> on this. Okay, well, for, for me, it, it's also very concerning to me because I expected that President Tinubu would have done much than he has done presently. Having perceived him as somebody who understood the Nigerian political climate and somebody who has been, who has been able to prove his mentor as governor of Lagos State, where he was stabbed or found for upward of two to three years by the then president, and so I thought he's coming with a whole lot of, you know, uh, background to hit the ground running. But it seems that what he met has also subtly overwhelmed him. Maybe that's the reason we have not seen much of him. However, himself being the, sub the, the, the substantive minister of petroleum, for me, is also something I really did not cherish. Because I expected him to come with a full-blown system that understand where to fix the gaps that have been identified, why he was outside. Mm. But that is not to be seen. Then, of course, talking about the CBN that, you know, befed us with this high, high level of, you know, cash crunch today, that mm. you go to the bank to withdraw your own money that you store in the bank, they will tell you that what they can give to you is 5000 And heads are not rolling at this point. It's very challenging to me. A Mephile is having his day in court. For, for quite some time now. Yeah. There is somebody, a new Caesar in the saddle. So what is happening? Why is our own money not getting to us? Mm. This is our own money we put in the bank. You want to withdraw money for your consumption, you don't have access to it. And somebody is not being held for mm. that. And nobody is telling us the truth. For me, I, I before now, I decided that I want to assess Mr. President after one year in office. <laughs> okay. Because... Okay. He's managing a budget that he met halfway, and he has also proposed his own budget, awaiting you know confirmation okay. by the National Assembly. Okay. So we'll be able to know exactly. So because there is no excuse that you can give that will justify failure. Exactly. Nigeria are in a hurry for somebody who want to you know make their life meaningful on a daily basis. Exactly. Not passing the buck or asking for all of the patients and patients and patients. There's a limit to human endurance. That is true. People are dying of starvation. People are dying of hunger. That so, is true. The reason why the anti-corruption agency are not probing those people who have been fingered in the way Nigeria expects it is also worrisome to me. Mm. So I think that in the coming days, ICPC, EFCC, Code of Conduct should be properly mobilized, funded, to the extent that they can go everywhere verify allegations and if there's a prima facie come up whole hearts and sinker then prosecute those people who are offenders thank you By so that, much Henry. there will be a deterrent for those who are in the saddle now thank you then